everyone, welcome to Academia School Simulator. Academia School Simulator is a management game that lets you design, construct, and manage the high school of your dreams. As the school principal, watch your students as they get bullied, find love, flunk exams, and basically just try to get through the roller coaster ride that is high school. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Academia is going to be one of those games to where it's like Prison Architect, and yeah, you're still kind of in a prison because, you know, we all thought high school was a prison. Am I right? I know I did. <laughs> anyway, I've been trying to figure out some things to do with the channel, and I really think that this is going to be a pretty good game. Um, I, I have a feeling that, uh, I mean, we all love and hated high school at the same time, right? Why not try and relive some of that stuff? So we're going to go ahead and just going to, we're just going to go ahead and start a new game. I just downloaded it. Uh, so bear with me. Um, <laughs> there's going to be a lot of learning curves here with this, but you know, I've seen some videos on it and, uh, again, it really reminds me just of, um, of prison architects. So we're just going to jump on in here. Uh, now school name, this is, um, Hmm. This is going to be very interesting. Why don't we go ahead and do, I mean, let's just stick to the Gemini thing here and let's go with uh, Gemini, Gem, oh my God, I cannot spell, Gem Enon. Hi. Okay. Uh, school motto. Hmm. Green is good. <laughs> Why not? Green is good. You know, Gemini, Gemini, Emerald is the birthstone of May for the Gemini. Are you following me here? I don't know if you are or not, but whatever. Okay, uh, so customize logo. Um, well, if we can have it green, there you go. <laughs> uh, secondary color. Um, you know, I think we'll go ahead and go with uh, orange. Orange looks really good. Well, okay, so it's yellow. It looks orange to me. Anyway. Uh, let's see. We have a compass. We have... Wow, there's a lot of different things that we can choose here. So let's go with... Let's go with... Uh, let's go with that. The long dragon. We'll do... Wow, this is very customizable. I like this. <gasps> no. Wait. Why is that... That's not right... It was hitting the wrong thing. I saw a Gemini symbol. I know I did. I know I did. Where did it go? Fried Scarlet, Carp, Key, Lantern, Long Dragon. Wait. Oh, there it was. Okay, I'm hitting back and it's not hitting the right thing. Oh, it's pie. Ha! <laughs> I'm a big dummy. Anyway, um, we'll go with uh, Dragon, Pie, Pizza? No. Um, let's see. Actually, that looks good. I like that. We'll go with that. We'll stick with that. Uh, let's see. School settings. We'll do... Uh, ooh, do we want to do co-ed? Yeah, we'll do co-ed. We'll do male, female. Okay. Uh, money. Why don't we go ahead and start off with 60000 Make it a little easy for us. Uh, let's see. Student settings. Delinquency. Calm. Devilish. Angelic. Yeah, let's do calm for our first one. Why not? Health, let's see, healthy, robust, sickly, eh, healthy, okay. All right, let's get into it, shall we? This is going to be so much fun, I'm telling you. <laughs> All right, yeah, right off the bat, I'm seeing, you know, like Prison Architect, first thing. <laughs> um, so, yeah, oh, wow. Wow, very big land. Very, very big land. I like that. Like that a lot. Now, this is Alpha 2, um, which was just released not too long ago. So if I go in here and if I look at Alpha 2, there were a lot of updates and stuff like that that happened. I'm not going to get too much into that because I myself don't really know the difference between the first version that came out and this one. Because since, you know, I'm just now playing this one. Um, but... You know, I will say that it looks like there's a lot of customization when it comes to the teachers. There's... Um, honestly, I don't know. There's just a bunch of new stuff happening, uh, <laughs> apparently. So why don't we go ahead and get into this? So our first to do, so our current grant. So again, same thing, just like prison architect. Uh, I'm going to shut up now about prison architect. We're going to focus on academia. We are academia now, not prison architect. <laughs> 
So our first to do is going to be uh, we need to build an office assigned to the principal and hire a principal. Okay, sounds easy enough. Um, delivery and garbage are over there, so I think I want to have... Okay, so I need to build and let's see, do I build a foundation or do I just build a wall? Looks like I can just build a wall. Um, wow, there's, <laughs> wow, a lot of different options in here. Okay. Okay, so it looks like I just build walls. I don't have an actual foundation that needs to be built. Okay, so the so then the very front of this then we'll do we'll do a brick wall in the front. Um, okay, so I have to click and drag. Got it. Does the um is that gonna connect yet this? Uh, let's see, zones, zones. I need to have um, let's see, administration, faculty lounge office so an office requirement is there do i have to is is there a minimum size for an office no no so let's make let's make the principal's office what like five by four okay um and then let's see let's build a wall around it okay now i need an admin table file cabinet fax and indoors Okay, well, I'm working on the indoors part. So, admin table, file cabinet. Uh, I'm going to need to put a door on here. Do I have a search option? I don't. I don't have a search option. I need to pause the game. Oh, it's under build. Uh, doors. Okay. Oh, okay. Walls, carpet, doors. Instead of all. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it would help if I actually looked to see what I was doing here. Um, all right. So a staff door. Okay. So we can hit R for rotate. Ooh, that's interesting. So the door itself, you can actually have, do you want it to be on that side or do you want it to be on this side? Interesting. Probably depicts the direction that the door opens. So let's put that there then. Should have made this office bigger, but whatever. Uh, all right, so I need a uh, fax file cabinet and admin table. Um, okay, so objects, we're going to need, let's see, staff lounge offices. So an admin table. Ooh, this is probably going to have to be bigger. All right, and then a file cabinet. Oh, maybe not. And then a fax. Um, huh. Fax is kind of an odd thing. Okay, let's put the fax there then. I like how it has that little person standing in front of it. <laughs> it shows you where exactly the person needs to stand. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Uh, oh, so if you if you right click, that does nothing. Okay. <laughs> I thought it did something, but it doesn't. Alright, so we have that. Let's fast forward. Let's get that stuff built. Okay. Oh, oh, we need to hire a principal. Okay, so staff, uh, worker, teacher, principal. And let's see, salary is $416 a day. Where's my money? Money's up here. Uh, every school needs one. Dispenses justice by assigning delinquent students to detention or counseling. Required office zone. Okay. And there's our principal. Nice. All right, so that, uh, let's see, unlocked basic educational grant and then principal's office is complete. All right. So that's our to-dos. So here's our grants. So basic education. Basic education, we have to, oh, okay, so we actually only have one that we can do. And then these are all the unlockable ones. Okay. All right. 
Let's see, basic education. Every school starts from the basics. Use this money to build a classroom for each year level. Open the zones menu and click the classrooms tab. Each seat you put in the classroom equals one student. So a $20,000 advance, $10,000 completion bonus gets us 10 prestige, $20,000 cancellation penalty. Well, we don't need to worry about that. Um, and then grant requirements. So we need a freshman, sophomore, junior, and senior classrooms. Okay. So we'll apply for that grant. Gets us 20,000 bucks. Now, if we're looking at the zones, if we're looking at classrooms, so we have freshman, sophomore, junior, senior. Okay, good. Um, is there a minimum? Let's see. Chalkboard, student chair. We need at least 10. We also need room for a chalkboard, an office table, and a chair. Okay. All right, so let's look to see. No, I want, I want objects. Um, I want classroom, okay. So a chair is just one. Chalkboard is a two by two. Student chair is just one, okay. And then an office table, okay. Uh, office table was two by two. Chalkboard is two by two. Routing info, interesting, okay. Monitor routing, janitor routing. Uh, build blueprint zones transfer e okay Ooh, blueprint wall outline object outline door outline haha -ha. all right that makes things a little bit easier um hang on i might want to uh uh carpets i might want to give the principal's office some uh, flooring <laughs> uh let's see flooring um Let's just go with uh, basic concrete tile for now. Uh, no, let's go with brown carpet. Let's do that. And then we'll do a concrete tile there. Okay. All right, so now we need to get started and we need to get four classrooms built. So if we have to have, let's go to blueprint and let's go to, let's see, an object outline. That's okay. That, how do I erase? Okay. Uh, so wall outline, door outline, right. All right. So four classrooms, I think what we'll do is, so this is going to be obviously the front hallway, like right here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Not entirely sure what this right here is going to be yet. Let's see, we have the principal's office there. And then let's create, let's put a hallway, say right here. And then that, eh, that's gonna be a little too big. One, two, three, four, five, six. So if I do six, ugh, why do I have to hit erase? Why can't I just right click to erase it? Put a hallway there. One, two, three, four, five, six. So is six by six gonna work? If I have to have 10 chairs in here, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. And then two, okay, let's do this. Object, object, door there. And then I'm going to need, there's 12 desks. That actually works. I think that'll work. It might be a little small. I might be going small with this. Considering how large this place is, it, it is very possible I could be going too small. But if I have to expand later, I will expand later. Why don't I... Yeah, because I want a hallway to stay here. So yeah, we'll do that. That'll work. And I need four of these. 
Okay. So I'm going to have two on this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then I'm going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we'll do that one there, that one there. Okay. Uh, so let's do this. So we'll build a wall and... I don't necessarily want to do a, a brick wall. I want to do... Huh. I like how there's different walls in here. Let's just do a concrete wall for now. Let's see, so a concrete wall going this way, that way, connect it down to there. That, that, and then that, okay. So then this is going to be our entrance. If we look at doors, main entrance, perfect. Absolutely perfect. I love that. I love how you can have um, a main entrance door on here. That's kind of cool. That's actually, that's really neat. I like that. Okay. Um, and then we'll do a regular door there. Another regular door there. There and there. Okay. Um, and then we'll be able to put some flooring in. Let's do... For the classrooms, I think we'll go ahead and do checkerboard flooring in each of the classrooms. Oops. So we'll do that. And then down the... Oh yeah, there's plenty more here. Oh, very nice. Hmm. Let's see, a paver floor. What do we want for the actual hallway? I don't want to do wood paneling. Um, huh. This is always so difficult. Let's do marble flooring. What is that, 20 bucks? Okay. So we'll do marble down the hallways. That'll be nice. Uh, let's do, let's see, in front here. Why don't I go ahead and put, what, the, like this diagonal flooring? That'll look nice. Uh, and then marble flooring can go in there. Okay. Let's fast forward this here. Um, so are we actually, okay, so cash flow right now, obviously losing money because of staff wages, uh, worker, principal, all that kind of fun stuff. Um, okay, so that'll establish that. Now, let's go ahead and assign the, uh, let's assign the rooms here. Let's go with uh, zones and uh, classroom. So the freshmen will go in here. The sophomores will go there. Juniors up here and then seniors up here. You know, it makes sense that you have one of each class, you know, just because you've got to have... Um, you know, once one graduates, the other one goes up. I mean, it, it only makes sense to do it that way. Um, and then for classroom, we need, let's see, 10 student chairs, office table, chair, and chalkboard. Okay, so office table. So let's put the office table, I guess, right there. And then the chair can go there. Uh, chalkboard can go here. Let's see, chalkboard can go there. And I mean, the classrooms are all pretty much going to be the same exact setup, just to, just to remain, or just to keep it, you know, simple. You know, we want to keep it simple. We want to make sure that, uh, oh crap, now I don't remember where this is going. Um, it's going to go there. And then this one's going to go there. Um, is that facing the right way? <laughs> I hope it is. Yeah, it is. Oh God, I have to single click every time. I can't just drag and go. So one, two, three, four. Oh, what's happening? Oh, it's the next day. <laughs> I'm like, what's happening? I don't know what's happening right now. I'm not paying attention. That's what's happening right now. Uh, one, two, three, four. So I can have, I'm hoping I can have 12 
in here. There we go. I'm like, what's happening? I can't select anything. Um, let's create, uh, <laughs> let's put a door on here so this guy can come out. Um, let's see, da, 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 doors, staff only door. Let's put that on there. <laughs> He's stuck. All right, um, I think I've got those doors on the wrong way, to be honest with you. Pretty sure I do. Okay, yeah, so the door opens that way. Got it. So, yes, the door is... The door is on the wrong direction. Um, how do I... Okay, I can dismantle the door. I need to flip those around. Dang it. Um, why don't I have a... Uh, why don't I don't have any walls in there yet. Or is that just a blueprint and did I forget to actually build the wall? Probably forgot to build the wall. Uh, concrete. Yeah, totally forgot to build the wall. Whoops. Alright, uh, build doors. Let's do this the correct way this time, shall we? There we go. Okay. Um, right. Alright, good. Awesome. Did that, uh, wait, did that complete our grant? Did we? Yeah, we're good. Hey! Awesome! All right. That makes me happy. <laughs> All right. Uh, hiring teachers and snack time. What? Vending machine snacks aren't super healthy, but your students need to eat something. Uh, you can find the vending machines by clicking on the objects menu in the All tab. Okay. $600 advance, $600 completion bonus, zero prestige, $1,200 cancellation penalty, and I need to have four of them. I mean, do I really need to have? I mean, uh, I don't know. Well, but here's what I can do. I can put them like right there. So let's apply for snack time. Looks like I can only do one at a time here. So objects, um, all... There has to be a way for me to search. Then again, it looks like this stuff is in alphabetical order, so that's perfect. So one, two, three, four. There you go. <laughs> there's there's four of them. Why not? I'm going to be really neat to see when I actually have students in here. I like how the doors and stuff open. I'm easily amused. Okay, I'm going to tell you that right now. I am very easily amused. So this whole thing is a lot of fun. <laughs> this is really cool. Let's see, department schedule. Wow. Got a lot of cool stuff in here. Yoinks. Man, I'll tell you what. This is going to be very in-depth and involved. I love it. Absolutely love it. Okay. Hmm. I just realized we don't have any... Uh, I don't have any flooring under the uh, the doors there. Uh, flooring. Um, do I want checkerboard under it? Or do I want... Yeah, let's do checkerboard underneath it. That's fine. Okay. All right. Very cool. Very, very cool. Um, I think we just got the... Uh, yeah, that's done. So we need to hire teachers now. Um... Wow, that's <laughs> that's different. Um, now, I know that one of the updates used to be or was that it used to be um, you would just hire a teacher for the classroom and that teacher would teach all subjects. Um, but that's not the case anymore. You actually have to hire teachers that are specific to that subject, which makes total sense because that's how it works in high school. You have to have certain teachers that do certain subjects. So we're going to go ahead and apply for that. Um, that gave us, what, $10,000 advance and a $5,000 completion bonus. So ugh, let's see how much this is actually going to hurt us here. Um, okay. I need to... I think I need to hire one of each. Is that what it is to do? Uh, so one teacher for science, language, math, art, history, PE... Right? Language, math, science, history, art, PE. Yeah. So one of each. 
Um, <laughs> all right, so I know that the the different ribbons definitely give us, um, you know, the rating. Um, let's see, degree, master's degree, sign on bonus. Oh, a doctorate degree. Very interesting. Um, and that also has to do with, you know, how much they get paid and everything else. Um, princess, I don't even know. I can't even pronounce that. <laughs> I really can't. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. Alright, Tristan. Tristan's actually pretty good in a lot of areas. Um, I obviously, I don't want to go with the really crappy teachers, but I also don't want to stack myself with really good teachers because I'm not really going to be able to afford it. Um, so let's do, let's do a mixture. Let's do, um, huh. All right. Well, princess here is, is pretty good at PE. So <laughs> why don't we, uh, hire her for PE? Um, Actually, did I did I do that? How do I how do I select you for that? No, no, I don't want to fire. Oh, assign teacher. Okay. Okay. All right. So I, I guess we can go through and hire the teachers first. Um. You're actually going to be really good in history, and you need to have a really good history teacher. So I'm going to hire you. I hated history in high school. Hated it. I was awful at it. I was the worst. I really was. It was just, oh my god. It was not my forte. Uh, we can use that guy for math. Beam Lapa. Beam Lapa is actually, well, I mean, PE and history. But I could also use her for art. What about this guy? Could use him for math or history. I need someone who's pretty decent in science. I mean, it's not. Oh, this guy, Rudy. Okay, we can do Rudy for science. All right, let's do this. Let's, um, so this guy, Lewis, I want to do for history. So we can assign him there. Uh, Christopher, Christopher, I want for math. And then Rudy, I want for science. So I need language and art. I need those two still. So, I mean, ugh, yikes. Language and art are kind of difficult. Ooh, well, ooh, no, you're too expensive. <laughs> um, I'm not going to hire you just yet. Uh, ugh, ooh, see, this is this is so difficult. Okay, we'll we'll do beam for uh, for art, and then I need a decent teacher that doesn't cost me a whole lot of money for language. Um, I'm not. I don't think I'm gonna find that. I mean, I could do Cirrus. You know, what? we'll do that. We'll do Cirrus for uh, for language. So the pool, sign Cirrus there, and then art we can assign you to there. Okay. All right, so teachers are hired. Awesome. That just unlocked a bunch of crap for us to do as well. Um, so here come the teachers. Here come Cirrus. <laughs> Where are these guys going? Why, why are you walking all the way up there? You're what? Dude, lady, really? Come on now. <laughs> Get over here to the classroom, shall we? Okay. Why are we not finished? Uh, why have we not finished building this stuff yet? I don't understand that. Uh, build flooring. Don't understand why that's not done, but whatever. Okay. All right. Oh, oh, I just realized that the planning stuff stays. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that the blueprints stay. That's ooh, ugh, eh, I don't like it. But okay, all right, that's fine. So why does it look like there's stuff happening that I don't understand this? Huh? Weird. 
Some of the stuff didn't get put in. I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't know if that's a bug. I don't know. So, and it does look like you have to be careful because you can actually pay for this stuff again. Which is kind of weird. But okay. Whatever. Um, you know what? I think, uh, huh. I think we're going to stop there. I do. I think, yeah, we're going to stop there because, um, you know, we're already 30 minutes in. We've got, uh, we've got a little bit done. Um, we don't have any students just yet, but hopefully, hopefully that'll be the case in the next episode. Once we get a little bit more of this done here. But I like where I like where we're at. You know, we have our classrooms, we have our teachers, um, and then we will go ahead and uh, we'll start our school year um, in the next episode. So yeah, this is this is fun. This is gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, tell me what you guys think. Um, tell me what you think of this teacher all the way up here. Um, oh, that's I think that's the PE teacher. So I think maybe she's exercising. Maybe <laughs> I mean it's possible. That, that could be why she's all the way up there. I don't know. Who knows? <laughs> anyway, let me know what you guys think uh, down in the comment section below. Um, this is, I think this is going to be a lot of fun. Um, and yeah, we'll, we'll just have to wait and see what happens from there. Um, God, I can't, I can't even think straight right now. So anyway, questions, comments, concerns in the comment section below. If you're just now joining the channel and you're just now coming across this, video go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you've already subscribed hit the notification bell so that you can get notified on when i upload videos i am definitely going to be doing a lot better job hopefully soon <laughs> with um, uploading every eight hours probably um, i'm gonna try and get uh, like three series going all at once um, so we've got this we've got prison architect going right now and uh i don't know probably think of something else to do too you just have to wait and see that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching, everyone, and I'll see you next time.